Scary. It's hard to imagine a place more distant from adventure. <laughs> what are these angles, man? Than a convent. Is it scary? So Indica is a third-person story-driven game with psychological horror, thriller, comedy, tragedy elements to it. And you basically play as a young nun who's on a journey of self-discovery who also gets accompanied by the devil. And on Steam it says it's set in a strange world where religious visions clash with harsh reality. No. It looks kind of creepy. I kind of like it. The heroine looks of very story, interesting. If it were up to her would have preferred to stay within its walls. However... I like the voiceover. Destiny had something different in store for her. I loved watching this gameplay trailer with you guys on stream and I feel like so many of you loved it. By the way, if you're not following me on Twitch, feel free to come and follow. It's a fun time. The link is in the description. Oh. What are these angles, man? Camera's like right here. Open it. This music is fun. Open it. Where's the devil? I did a little bit of research into the story as well because I was like, is this based on a true story or a book that's been written or something like that? I believe the story is inspired by Dostoevsky or Bulhakov, two Russian writers and novelists from the 1800s and their books basically involved themes of religion, politics and spirituality as well, just like the game. Oh, I'm scared. Oh, it's creepy. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is so creepy. This looks really fun. And if by chance you were to kill someone and go to jail, sooner or later you'd get pushed out of there as well. I love this gameplay trailer because I feel like it gave us such a good amount of information about the game and the story just in a short trailer. And I feel like combining horror and comedy always engages me so much. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like I always find it a lot easier to play horror games when there's something funny about the game. It kind of makes it a little bit more lighthearted for me because I get really easily scared. So where now? Huh? Huh? So Ooh. No, that's so creepy. This looks so odd, but actually quite fun. Whoa. Guys, I'm actually... It always feels really unexpected when comedy and thrillers or psychological themes are sort of combined but i like how it's unexpected as well the gaming development company is called odd meter they've released one other vr game before so it was purely a vr game but i feel like this game is going to be massive for them this is going to be the one and they've got a free demo available now and the release date is meant to be in 2024 so we will see if it's actually in 2024 but the exact date is to be confirmed don't forget to leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel all of my socials are linked in the description and i will see you in the next one bye